Wednesday night was the home opener for the men's basketball team as they welcomed Marywood to West Point. After falling behind 3-0, the Black Knights got things going and never looked back. To Herbeck up top, fakes the three, looks into the right corner, passes left corner for Lennox, who takes it around the perimeter, finds Panko, back to Herbeck, right corner, three-point shot, good! Back out to Panko, deep out on the right wing, up top Herbeck to Ellis, in the lane, down low, Steyer, put it in on the layup down low. Levon across the perimeter. Left wing Bikinde and the outlet pass gets by Levon, picked up by Lennox. Up court on Levon and he puts it in off glass. So Lennox with the steal and the conversion. Black Knights up by nine at 12 to three, coming down on 16-15 to play here in the opening half. To Springer up top, Panko right corner. Three point shot for Ellis, in and out. Rebound fought for, pulled away by Springer. Back to Ellis, Army able to reset. Harris in the left corner, Jalen tries baseline, kicks it to Ellis, three pointer from the corner, that one's good. Up top to Levan, working in on Lennox, kicks it out to Kai's, a three, off the back rim. Rebound tipped by Lennox, over to Herbeck, Army with it back after the defensive stop. Herbeck off to Lennox, right wing, in the lane for Steyer, off glass and good with Kai's defending. Steyer with six, Army by 19, and Eric Grunman calls a timeout. Marywood wanted to talk things over. The Black Knights would cruise to a 95-40 win. Herbeck led Army with a season-high 14 points. It's great to get that first one under our belt. You know, we want to come out, play hard, uh, and play an Army-style basketball. You know, really get after it on the defensive end. And uh, we knew the offense would take care of itself, but that was a big emphasis for us on defense. Head coach Zach Spiker says a performance like this will go a long way this season. That's what we're going to have to do to have success this year, and, and they know that, and it was good to see it reinforced. And they had a very good practice on Monday, and we were sharp yesterday and um, had a good option today. So, uh, you know, let's... Let's build on it. Let's learn from it. Every day, every game, every possession with a team this young, one can be an adventure, two needs to be a learning experience. And uh, hopefully we learned a good bit tonight and we'll be ready for our next challenge on Saturday. The Black Knights return to the court with a road trip to Central Connecticut State. Tip-off is at 2 p.m. Reporting from Crystal Arena, Rick Johnston, ITT Excellus Night Vision.